All right, everyone, let's dive into a discussion that's been on my mind lately. Given all the buzz about AMD and the new PS5 processor, do you believe FSR 3 will eventually make its way to the PS5? While it wasn't specifically mentioned, my hunch is that it will, perhaps they're just not ready to announce it yet. And with that out of the way, let's get into all the details. I've seen many comments expressing a desire for a quieter, cooler running PS5. Well, friends, we might just be in luck. As I came across an intriguing article on Insider Gaming, the rumored PS5 Pro, cryptically codenamed Project Trinity, has Sony enthusiasts buzzing with anticipation. Zuby underscore tech's recent leak claims that a revamped PS5 model is set to undergo two pivotal tech upgrades. The article mentions that, in contrast to the initial system's 7 nanometers chip, the upcoming model will boast a 5 nanometers APU. Oh, and if you've been hearing about the liquid metal saga, the new model ditches that entirely. But why the fuss, you ask? Well, the proposed 5 nanometers APU not only consumes less power but also ensures reduced thermal output, tinier die sizes, and ramped up computing speeds. The end result? A more streamlined and efficient gaming machine. However, there's still a lingering question. Are these advancements exclusively for the PS5 Pro or a refreshed standard PS5? Insider Gaming is working to independently confirm the information. Should any more information be received, this story will be updated accordingly. Sony's gaming portfolio is about to get a multiplayer boost, as they set sights on acquiring Firewalk Studios, a subsidiary of Probably Monsters. The goal? To curate an original AAA multiplayer game tailored for the PlayStation 5 and PC platforms. This move doesn't come as a surprise given Sony's recent acquisition spree, with both Destiny creator Bungie and the Jade Raymond helmed Haven Interactive Studios joining the Sony family last year. Furthermore, in a statement back in February 2022, Sony disclosed its ambitious plans to unveil over 10 live service games by March 2026. While specifics about this upcoming game remain under wraps, Herman Hulse, the bigwig at PlayStation Studios, expressed his admiration for the project's vision in a recent PlayStation blog post. Hulse emphasized Firewalk's aspiration to revolutionize how players connect in multiplayer realms. Building on the excitement, Hulse remarked in a press release, anticipate some incredible offerings from Firewalk. Traditionally, Sony's forte has been its cinematic single-player titles. However, with Microsoft's looming acquisition of Activision Blizzard, the masterminds behind Call of Duty, Sony's pivot to enhance its multiplayer catalog seems strategic. Beyond Firewalk's venture, Sony's multiplayer endeavors include ownership of the beloved Destiny 2, a collaborative project with Haven, and a new multiplayer quest in the ever-expanding Horizon universe by Guerrilla Games. Alright guys, let's move on to the big news, AMD FSR 3, will it come to PS5? Let's find out. AMD has unveiled its next-generation graphics technology at Gamescom 2023 with the much-anticipated third iteration of Fidelity FX Super Resolution, FSR 3, finally seeing the light of day, coinciding with the launch of their RX 7800 XT and 7700 XT graphic cards, cards seemingly poised to challenge NVIDIA's RTX 4060 T offerings. The big news revolves around AMD's FSR 3. This technology leverages their new Fluid Motions Frame FMF system aiming to drastically improve game frame rates. As September rolls in, gaming enthusiasts can expect FSR 3 to be incorporated into two PC games. AMD's projection is even more ambitious for the months that follow, suggesting thousands of games will soon be FSR 3 ready. This update will be compatible with an array of AMD graphic cards, spanning from the Radeon RX 6000 to the 7000 series. Even some of their legacy cards could potentially benefit from this update. Interestingly, Microsoft's Xbox, outfitted with a custom AMD Radeon GPU, will support FSR 3, but there was a conspicuous absence of any mention related to Sony's PlayStation 5. In a twist, AMD dropped an additional bombshell. The company revealed ongoing work to make FSR 3 compatible with all Direct X11 or 12 games, paving the way for numerous titles to gain substantial frame rate improvements. This update is slotted for an early 2024 release. Lastly, AMD's collaboration with Bethesda Softworks was spotlighted. They'll be providing both GPU and CPU for the eagerly awaited Starfield game, while specific specifics were kept under wraps, AMD did hint that the game will deliver an optimized performance on their hardware. For more PS5 Pro and PS5 Slim, here's a playlist. Or if you just want the PS Pro scoop, here's this video.